just checking out the garden again. We didn't get out last Sunday because heavy rain was forecast, and once again the forecast has got it wrong. But the UK continues to get battered by fairly high winds. Today is a day of heavy skies. The temperature is pretty mild, but is undermined by the constant wind. Red kite continue to wheel in the skies above. They will have already paired up and will have several potential nest sites, and their eggs are usually laid in April. Despite the rough weather, our journey into spring continues, with abundant buds and blossoms. It won't be long before the nesting season is in full swing, and I continue to put food out well into the summer, and it looks like another trip to the suppliers is imminent. But here's the real reason for this Nature Notebook edition. Lots of frog activity in our garden pond. Only a couple of days ago, as I was clearing out some of the duckweed, I pondered on when the first sighting would be. And here they are. Common frogs emerge from their overwintering sites in early spring and head straight to ponds to breed. And they'll often return to the pond where they were spawned. Breeding involves males attaching themselves to the females by grasping them under the forelegs where they'll stay until the females lay the eggs or spawn. And then the spawn is fertilized by the males spraying their sperm over it. And the spawn can be fertilized by more than one male. And as you can see, there's already a good batch of spawn in the pond and I can almost guarantee that there'll be even more by tomorrow. See you next time.